<laughs> Sup, update. Sup, date. That could be a new word. I like that. Anyway, December 18th. I had sort of been messing around with the concept of doing these little sort of like we're vlogging. I experimented with this over the summer when I had more time when I was in Belgium. I'm down here working. It's a nice cold, freezing cold Sunday here in Boston, Massachusetts. The Mags Master for the first single is done. That's really exciting. That record's gonna crush. Uh, over there, we've got the football game. Hoping that the Jets lose so that helps the Patriots. I'm gonna be working with some mentoring students today, which is cool. Um, digging into their stuff. I haven't taken on as many of those as I have in the past just because my schedule's been a little bit busy, but if you're interested in doing the mentoring program with me, uh, shoot me a DM or I can send you the contact for that. It's been really dope. And I've gotten to meet so many cool engineers and like it's been really helpful for them and really fun for me. So that's cool too. Let's see, next month, um, Andy and I are leaving. Uh, we're going to Pale, Pale Ranch, uh, Alex is gonna kill me, Pale Moon Ranch. It's in California and we're gonna go do, we're gonna start tracking the first Death of a Nation LP. This is the first LP that uh, we've done since Empty Days and Sleepless Nights back in 2011. So it's mostly written, the songs, <laughs> the songs are really good, I think. Um, you know, having taken like such a long break for such a long time, coming back and writing again Especially, I'm like a lot older now too. It's like writing this energetic stuff. But I think the break was helpful because I think, I don't think I would have written this had I sort of been like low on creative gas, not as much fuel in the tank. I don't know what I'm saying. But basically what I'm saying is that a long break with writing with Andy, we did four songs like in 2017 and then another break. Anyway, so we're really excited to start working on that. Um, yeah, and they'll come back from that. And then I start an LP in February with Salem Wolves. So we'll be doing that here. Monster is doing great. Uh, if you haven't tried it, definitely try it. If you don't know what it is, it's a, in my opinion, the best sounding artificial intelligence mastering algorithm on the internet. But we've also added a bunch of really cool stuff too. So you can use it uh, as like a collaboration tool for like you and your bandmates and a mix note tool. Um, you can resequence your album in there. It's free to try, so try it, it's awesome. And there's a litany of features and benefits and we have a lot of happy users. You could be one of them. Uh, let me see, anything else? Oh yeah, this is a cool thing. Uh, so right when the pandemic hit, or I should say like right before the pandemic hit, I mixed uh, a single mother's record and then we, the world shut down. And then so like, we just didn't put it out, but then we finished it. But by the time it was basically done. And then Drew, the vocalist of Single Mothers was like, I just need to give you one more vocal stem. And two years later, he's like, hey, can we finish the record? And I was like, yeah, do you have that vocal stem? And he's like, oh no, it's fine how it is. We can, we can just finish it. That was just, you know, the pandemic. And I was like, sure. Anyway, in that time, he had written a whole other record. So he asked me to mix that one too. That's called Roy. And I guess the label's doing something really cool where they're like sending copies. So we, we backing up, like we had two LPs at the same time, mixed, like finished and totally unreleased. So we released the one and then Roy has just been like waiting in the wings. So today on Instagram, I saw the label sending out copies of Roy to people who bought copies of the first one we did. And then so I guess people are starting to get that record now. So I, I don't know when it's gonna be out on DSPs and stuff, but I thought that was a really cool little thing that's happening. So, and both LPs are sick too. So check them both out. And for the, the very special lucky of you who got Roy, uh, nice, congrats. Feel free to uh, let me know if this is <laughs> a waste of your time in the comments or if like just stuff like this is, you know, content is cool. So yeah, all right, 42 year old man posting on the internet. Let's do this.